I think that older generations just have a harder time listening to younger generations. But when we, like when all of us are up in the government, things are going to change so much for the better when all of us are up there and these guys are out. Are you guys going to run for Congress one day? Maybe, who knows? <laughs> you know, like, I'm, I don't want, like, I don't want to be a politician, but seeing, like, the need for, like, liberal people and representation of better issues than, like, you know. Are you guys resentful at all that you have to do this? Yes. Yeah. Every day. Shouldn't have to happen. We shouldn't have a march called March for Our Lives. We shouldn't be scared for our lives. We're just going to school. And how old are you? I'm 17. Um, and what year are you? I'm a junior. Mm -hmm. And what city are you from? Athens, Ohio. Okay. Why did you guys decide to come? Uh, well, our school is very liberal and we all kind of have like the same ideas We're about this kind of things. Like we went to the Women's March and we are hearing about all this gun violence and a lot of us are really shocked and really hurt by this and we're learning about it in our classes and we're like, this isn't okay, we want to do something. We go to a Quaker school and Quakers are like kind of peaceful protesters. Like we're not going to go to riots or something like that, but we definitely will march. Yeah. I'm with it. No guns. We don't like our rooms, our buildings. We don't have locks because that's just like the way that religion is, um, like trust with each other. So it's not like if someone came to our school, we could just lock ourselves in a classroom, like with the public schools. It's so. Is that something you want? No, definitely not. I okay. love the way our school is and our community and our school is that we have so much trust with each other because that's kind of what makes our school different from other schools. seconds with an AR-15 and my friend Carmen would never complain to me about piano practice. Aaron Feist would never call Kira Miss Sunshine. Alex Schachter would never walk into school with his brother Ryan. Scott Beagle would never joke around with Cameron at camp. Helena Ramsey would never hang out after school with Max. I think that we're definitely gonna get heard. I think that this isn't something that the United States can ignore if there's this much of backlash from this. If we're gonna be marching in Washington DC then they can't ignore us and I think that they have to listen to us and they're gonna have to do something or just more revolts, more marches. Sorry. 